17. Let's look at the forecast with meteorologist Tammy Sousa. Ooh, don't you love the sun when it, it comes up and so looks like this? Beautiful. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's going to be a gorgeous sunrise. 644. That is the sunrise this morning. So grab your coffee and peek out the window if you can see it. Uh, down the shore, though, take a look at this. I mean, this is the Atlantic City. This is the harbor, and it's very quiet. All the boats are there. It's not a great day for boating, by the way. There's small craft advisories and gale warnings out on the water. But one of the boats already very festive, kind of getting into the holiday spirit with the holiday lights. We love to see that. Uh, the water temperature 57 degrees, so it's not really great swimming uh, temperature. We're looking at the shore points all in the 40s, except Atlantic City in the 30s. Now, let's go inland. I mean, Lewis Beach, you were at 49 degrees. That's pushing 50 degrees. That is about the warmest spot we have. 43 in Philadelphia, 37 in Allentown, 36 in Reading. Big surprise in the Poconos, we're looking at 42 degrees, but you may see a rain snow mix there today, so temperatures will be falling quickly. We do have a chance of showers today. This is what you need to know. We're going to have a windy afternoon as well, so you're going to have to pull that coat tightly around you, or maybe keep an eye on those uh, decorations you've put up outside. Perhaps some of the patio furniture. Things could blow around, especially down the shore. And we're going to get a fast cool down this afternoon. This front is going to come through, and temperatures are going to start to plummet. By the time we get into this evening, we'll be in the 30s and maybe near 40 in Philadelphia. We have a wind advisory for all the shore points. So all of you from Tom's River all the way through Atlantic City, Sea Isle City, and we're looking at Cape May. That's from 1 to 7 today. That's because 45 mile an hour wind gusts are possible. Again, that is going to blow things around. Loose power lines, tree branches could come down, so be aware of that. We do have clouds already making their way into the Lehigh Valley and the Poconos. Sprinkles trying to make it to the ground. However, the atmosphere is still pretty dry, so it's only where you see these darker shades of green. Here it comes, and there it is, that we might actually see some light showers making it to the ground. We have a better chance with the main front and the main band of rain coming out of Pittsburgh behind that cold enough air to produce some snow showers. So let's walk you through it. We have southeast winds this morning. They're very breezy, but not like we're going to see later today. We make it to the 50s in Philadelphia, 56 there, low 60s down the shore, and only the 40s up into the Poconos and the Lehigh Valley. Now we start to really see that rain pick up. I think between about 11 and 2 is the best chance of rain showers, not a total washout. Thunderstorms, I think, will be farther to the north than, uh, than in our area. And maybe a spotty shower down the shore, but I generally think the shore and southern Delaware staying dry. Here we are, 6.30 this evening. We're down to 41 in Philadelphia, 37 in Allentown, 43 in Atlantic City. Temperatures continue to fall overnight. You're going to wake up to the 30s in the morning. We'll see sunshine tomorrow. It'll be lovely. It'll be a quiet day. Only in the 40s is where we'll top out. And then here comes the next front. It's going to bring us some snow showers in the Poconos, maybe a quick shot of showers across the area. Then we go into the 30s for Monday morning. Let's take a look up here, Lehigh Valley and the Poconos. First flakes are possible in the Poconos. So some showers by about 11 this morning. Then we move ahead, and here we go, about 2 o'clock. Could see a little rain snow mix up into the Poconos. Do not think this affects you in the Lehigh Valley. A coating at best, and then everything is out of here. So for today, we're looking at 57 in Philadelphia. Windy with a chance of showers, turning colder late. 49 for tomorrow, so it'll be chilly and brisk. It'll feel like the low 40s, but we will see a bit more sunshine. Then we get into 50 on Monday, 51 Tuesday, back to the 60s on Wednesday. That's nice. And we could see our next chance of showers Thursday night. We'll see 60s Thursday and then back to the 50s mm. on Friday. Jan? A nice little dry stretch there, yes. though. Thank yes. you, Tammy.